Did you know that any Espressive SOC from the 32, C, S and A2266 series can be used as a wireless network interface controller, enabling other IoT devices and MCUs to access the internet? Well, Espressive's new ESPWNIC solution offers just that. So users can choose the Espressive SOC that suits their application scenario best, benefiting from the low development cost, easy maintenance and highly scalable functions that all Espressive SOCs offer. With the ESPWNIC solution, users can quickly join a wireless network, connect to a cloud platform, transmit data and implement remote control functions. The ESPWNIC solution can be widely used in smart home applications, consumer electronics, weather monitoring, equipment monitoring and high-tech agricultural solutions. In this video, we will take ESP32 as an example of Wi-Fi and Bluetooth SOC connectivity and we will present two WNIC solutions, ESP8 t and ESP Hosted. We will talk about their adaptability, the resource demands of the MCU involved, the throughput data size in each case, and some typical application scenarios. Using an Espressive SOC as a WNIC that gives internet access to other MCUs is a great way to implement the wireless, solid and secure connectivity that ESP SOCs offer. To this end, Espressive has a variety of chips with integrated Wi-Fi and Bluetooth connectivity. For example, Espressive's new ESP32 SIS6 chip with its integrated Wi-Fi 6 offers higher transmission rates and lower power consumption than ever before. ESP32 SIS6 also integrates Bluetooth 5 for long-range communication based on advertising extensions and coded PHY. ESP32 C3 and ESP32 S3 also support Wi-Fi and Bluetooth 5. ESP32 S3 further supports AI acceleration, enabling high-performance applications such as image recognition, voice recognition and voice wake-up. Using ESP32 C6, ESP32 C3 or ESP32 S3 as a WNIC provides a superior yet cost-effective internet access to your system while also ensuring excellent performance. Now let's take a look at the two WNIC solutions that Espressive currently offers. esp is a wireless connectivity solution developed by Espressive which can be used directly in mass production. It combines the application of wireless and network protocols, so even users with little knowledge of these protocols can quickly join a network and connect to a cloud service. esp has such a high level of integration that users can modify Bluetooth parameters, perform a domain name resolution, upgrade firmware, and send HTTP requests just by sending simple strings. With esp the ESP device is connected to the host MCU via a peripheral bus for the purpose of receiving and sending AT commands and also for transmitting network data. While the ESP device runs both the wireless and the network stack, the MCU only needs to pass the strings in order to control the wireless functions and the network services of the ESP device. Users can also quickly connect their devices to a cloud platform and therefore enable functions such as data communication and remote control. Now we'll demonstrate the functions of esp by using a computer as the MCU which sends commands to the ESP device. Connect the ESP device to the computer. Then use a serial port tool to send and receive data. Send AT plus GMR to get the version number of the ESP device. Send AT plus GSLP to put the ESP device into the low power mode, check the remaining memory space, or set the RF power. Next, we'll demonstrate the ESP AT WNIC solution, which connects the entire system to the Wi Fi network by provisioning the ESP device over a mobile phone. First, we'll send a few simple AT commands to create a Wi Fi hotspot on the ESP device side and launch a web server. When the phone gets connected to the Wi-Fi hotspot, 
communication with the ESP device is established and therefore a web server page will pop up reminding users to enter their Wi-Fi account and input their password for provisioning. From this point onwards, the ESP device can function as a WNIC allowing the entire system to connect to a Wi-Fi network and perform network operations. For example, by sending a simple AT command, we can visit Espresso's website and download a picture. This solution is applicable to Linux, RTOS and non-OS SDKs with a data throughput of up to 10 Mbps. ESP Hosted is another WNIC solution developed by Espressive which is similar to ESP AT in terms of hardware connection but with a different software implementation. In ESP Hosted, the ESP device runs the entire wireless protocol while the MCU runs a network protocol stack such as TCP IP. ESP Hosted is more flexible than ESP AT allowing users to adjust constrained application protocols, web sockets and other application scenarios to their actual needs. ESP Hosted supports Linux and RTOS with a throughput of more than 20 Mbps, which is suitable for more complex network applications such as setup boxes, robotics and video transmissions. Here is a demo of using an ESP device as a WNIC that provisions a Raspberry Pi. The Raspberry Pi device is not connected to the network at this point. According to the relevant documentation, we should load the driver of the ESP device on the Raspberry Pi so that the Raspberry Pi is then able to recognize the ESP device. Users can easily access the internet by connecting the ESP device to the designated Wi-Fi with Linux commands. Now by using the Raspberry Pi, we can access for example Espressive's video web page and watch the latest videos. When comparing ESP AT and ESP Hosted, we can easily conclude that ESP Hosted should be preferred for complex applications or situations that require high throughput. In such cases, however, the host MCU needs to run the entire network protocol stack, so the MCU performance requirements are equally higher. For less complex applications with lower throughput demands, the ESP AT solution is the way to go. In this case, the ESP device can run both the full wireless protocol stack and the network protocol stack, while the MCU passes only simple strings. This protocol makes programming significantly less complicated. So if you want to implement, for example, the functions of a tablet or a setup box, both of which require high throughput and considerable programming flexibility, you should choose the ESP hosted solution. But if you just want to control simple home appliances which do not require a high network data throughput, you should choose the ESP AT solution. If you'd like to learn more about Espressive's solution to wireless network interface controllers, or if you have any questions about ESP WNIC, please contact our customer support team by clicking on the link in the video description below. Thanks for watching.